Listen, criticism is about to happen to you. One thing that you will quickly learn is that not everyone will love you, like you, and support you in life like you expected. And most importantly, you must know that people don't have to like you, and you don't have to care. Remember, you cannot stop people from criticizing you. You just have to learn how to deal with the criticism. Hey, this is Candace from CreateFreedomWithCandace.com. This channel is dedicated to help parents like me want more freedom in life. If you want to learn how to create a passive income online from the comfort of your own home, then click the top link in the description for my number one recommended training. No matter who you are and what you do, people will always question your moral, motive, and even who you are. That's criticism. People will criticize what they don't like about you and what you are doing and you don't have to listen to them, right? Well, right and wrong. Sometimes we have to listen to it because despite our belief, we might be doing the right thing in a way that affect people negatively. The thing is we won't know who to listen to criticism make us angry make us feel as we need to defend ourselves defending yourself when dealing with criticism often come out the wrong way so before you do anything you have to know how to deal with criticism and how to deal with haters the trolls and the people that feel threatened that you are making progress you need to master the art and deal with criticism like a boss remember on your journey to be a boss mama and building your empire you will face a lot of criticism and here is how to deal with it. understand why you're doing what you're doing if you know what you're doing it's right know what you stand for and believe in yourself and what the future hopes then all you have to do is to keep your stand whatever they think doesn't matter when you have a clear why and doing something great will always remind you why you're doing it every single day until it become automatic a lot of time when people question our belief we tend to start doubting ourselves because we forgot our why know your why and stand by it your worst credit is your inner credit. The truth is, before people start criticizing you and notice that you're doing something great, there's always that little fear and doubt keep nagging at you inside, preventing you from doing what you want to do, criticizing you. Until you learn to silence your inner credit by straining your subconscious, then you can really deal with other people. Feed your subconscious with daily affirmation. Listen to motivational podcasts. Continue with personal development and master the skill that you need to grow in whatever niche that you're in. Number three, expect criticism. Here's the truth. Before you're doing something great, you need to have it in the back of your mind that people will come at you. No great person became great without going through critics during their journey. When you're expecting the criticism, it will be easier to ignore it and deal with it. Take it and understand it as a part of the journey that will strain you when you answer your every why question about your journey because to yourself, it will be easier to tell your why to others and it actually make your belief of this stronger. Number four, are they right? When there's a lot of people criticizing you, especially when it comes to including those you trust, take a step back. Still keeping your why in mind and look at yourself objectively and ask yourself, are they right? It might be your time to question your why. If there's a truth to what they're saying, go back where it started and fix it and then go on with your plan. It will strengthen you and make you a better person. Number five, understand their why. Like it or not sometimes you will need to put yourself in their shoes see why they're doing it some people have some mental issue that they are dealing with so there's no point for you to argue with that kind of people when you put yourself in their shoes and understand where they're coming from you will learn to deal with them better sometimes it's just about redefining your message to them maybe they will understand or ignore them all together here's number six are they qualified to criticize you here's the ugly truth some people will criticize you because they don't understand what you're doing or they feel like they know better than you do. Not everyone will see what you see. Until they can see what you see, you have to ask, are they qualified to criticize me? No, then don't accept criticism from them. Number seven, respond on your own terms. When someone criticizes you, you have these following options. Number one, respond right away which most of the time is so like a defensive and make you angry number two take some time to process what it is and respond go back to the last few steps that we just talked about and number three ignore them all together now the best option are the last two there are time and people you must respond to but take time to process and follow step four five and six that we just talked about before you respond to their criticism sometimes it could be as easy as reframe 
your message in a different way. Then there are those that you just have to ignore it altogether. People who don't know what they are talking about, people are just haters and came from a jealousy place, you just have to ignore it. No matter what the situation is, always take time out and think it through and act accordingly. Remember, there's nothing's wrong with you and what you're doing. Don't force people to see your vision. No two eyes will ever see the thing the same way. Remember that famous dress with everyone see different color, gray or pink or black, whatever. Perfect example of what we're talking about here. Remember, criticism is a part of the journey to become something bigger in life. People will always want to see just how far they could push you and even try to bully you till you give up just so that they can say, I told you so. Always, always remember your why. There you have it. Seven tips on how to deal with criticism and haters like the boss mama while you're building your empire. Again, this is Candace from createfreedomwithcandace.com. I'm here to help you to live a freedom lifestyle that you and your family deserve. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel by clicking the logo right around here. If this is your first time watching, well, hello, nice to meet you. Be sure to comment so that I can say hi back. If you are sticking around on YouTube, be sure to click the top right corner on my next video because that's the next one that you want to see. I will see you next time. Bye.